เอกโกลาโนอิเคอีอาย What started in the early 1980s as a humble yet steadfast attempt to bring the nearly extinct native Hawaiian language back to the mouths and ears of our babies, the Punanaleo has become one of Hawaii's leading early educational programs. A status that was confirmed by the full accreditation of the Punanaleo preschools by the World Indigenous Nations Higher Education Consortium, or WINHEC. WINHEC is godsend because it represents. All these different people working together to support indigenous peoples in the world. We have a lot of Western mainstream accrediting bodies out there for, you know, early education, but there's nothing with an indigenous foundation. So WinHEC fills that space. This allowed Ahapunanaleo to be exactly who they are and to shine as stars through that process. They were absolutely exceptional. I think the value of going through this process is to reaffirm and to confirm what the Ahapunanaleo has been doing all these years has actually borne fruit. It is a positive reaffirmation of the efforts expended by generations of Hawaiian in retaining the language. The accreditation team united educators from indigenous communities around the world, including Alaska, Norway, New Zealand, and our own Hawaiian language community. As was the case with Kanoi, a former Punanaleo parent and Hawaiian immersion teacher. It made me miss and love it all over again. I mean, I just have this renewed sense of pride for Aha Punanaleo. And this work, it's 20 years later, and the work is still critical and relevant and important. One of the things that I noticed was in that space, Hawaiians are loved, right? And they're nourished, and like it's just this really, really good space. It was really nice to be back in that space again. <laughs> What I think is done, a new generation of Hawaiians are now committed, are passionate, and are very hungry for their language, and are fighting to ensure its survival. And I think it will survive. I saw five dynamic young ladies with a group of children, and I was very, very impressed. The aha is not only providing a rich language environment and producing the next generation of Hawaiians that are, you know, akamai and eleu and, and know what's going on and know who they are and where they're from. But it is a rich cultural and academic, which I don't think the two are separate, environment. And the children's comprehension is made evident by the way they respond and the spontaneous comments that they make during whatever's being done. The Punanaleo were the very first preschools ever to be accredited by WINHEC, an honor, but one that took foresight, commitment, and determination. And ask all the citizens of the Aloha State to join all of us in applauding its landmark accreditation. They opened the path. They opened the opportunity for other Native Hawaiian organizations to go through the accreditation process. They opened the opportunities for others in, in the nation and the world. Really powerful inspiration for the entire global world of indigenous peoples to have come so far with your program. You have persons who are speakers and who will become first language speakers. That's a kind of victory for APL. Raising new generations of native language speakers through a rigorous educational system that is preparing them for academic success well into the future. This is the Punanaleo.